In this video, we'll do the sum of tangent k times tangent k plus 1 from k equals 0 to k equals n. Also, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss the video. Okay, we know that tangent of a plus b is tangent a plus tangent b all over 1 minus tangent a tangent b. So, this almost looks right, but the thing is we want this to be telescoping. So we want the top to be tangent a minus tangent b. So let b go to minus b. Now what will happen is tangent of negative b, since it's an odd function, it will be the same thing as minus tangent b. So we're going to have tangent of a minus b will be tangent a, now will be minus tangent b, because of the odd function, over 1 plus, because negative negative is plus, tangent a tangent of b. Okay, good. So now we can cross multiply. So we can do a cross like that. So what we're going to get is 1 plus tangent of a times tangent of b is equal to tangent a minus tangent b. But then we'll have multiplied by tangent a minus b. So we'll just divide by tangent a minus b. So now we can just plug in a equals, so we have k and k plus 1, right? So a equals k plus 1, and b equals k, because tangent k times tangent k plus 1 is the same thing as tangent k plus 1 times tangent k. Okay, so we're going to have 1 plus tangent k plus 1 times tangent of k, and this will be equal to tangent of k plus 1 minus tangent of k all over. And I choose chose a to be bigger than b, so a minus b is positive, so this will be k plus 1 minus k, so the input will be tangent of 1, and that's a nice number. Okay, so now we have 1 plus this, but we want it by itself, so how do we get it by itself? Obviously, if we, we subtract by 1 on both sides, and then this will go away. So we have the sum from k equals 0 to n of tangent k, tangent of k plus 1, it's the same thing, this will be the sum from k equals 0 to n of tangent of the top, and then we'll, tangent 1 can just be divided by the whole thing, minus tangent k, okay, tangent of k, okay, and then we're going to have all divided by tangent of 1, since it's addition, you can do this, or so, yep, yeah. and then we're going to have minus the sum from k equals 0 to n of just the number 1, okay, so let's look at this, how do we evaluate this? So it's just a constant 1, so we're going to look at the top point, the top end point minus the bottom end point, so that'll be n minus 0, but then we have to add 1. So n minus 0 plus 1 is n plus 1 times 1, so this is just n plus 1 in parentheses, and I'll just leave it like that. Okay, so this will be parentheses n plus 1. Okay, good. So what is this? This will telescope, so you're going to have tangent 0... 0 plus 1 is 1, minus tangent of 0, plus tangent of 2, minus tangent of 1, so on and so forth, all the way up to, let's look at the n minus 1 case, so we're going to have tangent of n minus 1 minus tangent of n, yeah, no, actually, the other way around, tangent n minus tangent n plus, yeah, minus tangent of n minus 1, and then we're going to have finally tangent n plus 1 minus tangent of n. Okay, so this is part of the sum. Okay, minus tangent of 0 is sine 0 over cosine 0. Cosine 0 is 1, so this goes away to 0. Okay, so tangent 1 and minus tangent 1 will cancel. This will be tangent 3 minus tangent 2, so this will cancel with something. Tangent of n plus n minus 1 will cancel because you have tangent of n minus 2 minus tangent of n minus 1. Okay. Tangent of n will cancel, leaving us with just tangent of n plus 1. Okay. So this will just be, so our, our sum will be tangent of n plus 1 divided by tangent of 1 minus parentheses n plus 1. So that is the end of the question. And let's just do an example. So we have the sum from k equals 0 to 3 of tangent k times tangent 
k plus 1. Okay, so this should be equal to, it will be equal to, so n equals 3 plugging in to this, so this would be s of n. So this will be tangent of 3 plus 1, which is 4, minus all over, sorry, tangent of 1 minus, four. now this is why I did the parentheses, so 4 and n is 3. Yeah, so this will be the same thing, so 4. And that is the end of the video. Hope you liked it, and thanks for watching.